Hey everyone, today I will review the Dreamboard theme called OS 7 Revive. Just check out the description on how to get this theme on your iPhone for us. Somebody asked me if I will review this theme, so here it is. So first, let's check out the lock screen. On the bottom left of the screen, you will get the notifications. This shows that I have two new emails, while this one is my calendar event. Then above it is the current time and date. Let's slide this up to unlock the screen. This is the main screen which features the live tiles. You can customize everything in here, which is pretty cool. This is the best Windows Phone 7 theme that I tried so far. If you have any notifications, you can see it in the tiles as well. Over here, it says that I have two new emails. Right here is my photos app, which shows my photos in a Ken Burns effect. So that's really nice. The music app displays the album artwork of whatever song is currently playing. As you can see here, it is playing one of the Transformers soundtrack and you just also saw the animation when an app is opened or closed, which you don't see in other Windows Phone 7 theme for the iPhone. Over here, some apps don't get the tile appearance if you pin them on the main screen, so I hope that they will improve this later on. I can move the tiles up or down as well as unpin them from the main screen. If you want to add more tiles in the main screen, simply press and hold onto the app that you want to add. Then either choose pin to start or show in lock screen. On this page, I have all the apps on my iPhone 4S. So just scroll up and down to see all the apps. I am pretty sure that there is a Cydia tweak that gets rid of the status bar. So just look for it and install it so you get that full Windows Phone 7 look. Now let's go ahead and customize this theme. Here you can change the wallpaper and the tile background. You can choose from a bunch of wallpapers right here, but I prefer a black wallpaper to emphasize the live tiles. Later I will show you how you can use your own wallpapers instead of these default wallpapers. It's really simple. Next, here are the tile backgrounds. Let's go ahead and change mine to this dark red color. And just press on the check icon. And that's it. Now, my live tiles have a red background. On the other Windows Phone 7 theme that I tried, you have to change a bunch of things in the themes folder in order to do this. But with this theme, you can do it right from the settings. So that's really convenient. Now let's go ahead and open iFile so I can show you where you can put your own wallpapers to replace the ones included in this theme. Okay, just go to var slash mobile slash library slash OS7. Then open the images folder. Then open up the wallpapers folder. This is where you will upload your own wallpapers. Just change the names and replace the ones in here. Also make sure that you have the right resolutions for those wallpapers because that will mess up the look of the theme. Let's go ahead and get out of here. So that's it for my review of the Dreamboard theme called OS 7 Revived. Again, this is the most complete Windows Phone 7 theme out there. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like my videos. Bye.